Hey, it's Zach here. We've already shown you the snap plate that goes on the Model 3. Well, today we're gonna to show you the snap plate version for the Model X. Next on Now You Know. All right, so this is probably one of the most straightforward plate installations you're gonna have, but Jesse, we had to do something a little different. Why was that? Um, so normally, Everything that comes with the snap plate is totally everything that you need because it comes with uh, four screws, either uh, silver, and they also come with black in case you wanted black screws, which is really nice, and they're security torques, so no one's gonna be able to take your, your license plate off with anything. And again, there's also that safety uh, security spot where you can stick your little security torques and no one is going to be the wiser. They're not gonna know how to take off the plate, so that will prevent them from snapping the plate off. Um, I didn't put it in, so that's why it didn't work. But the one problem that we ran into is that we have uh, this giant transponder for uh, Massachusetts and, you know, easy pass. And so the problem with this uh, tran trans uh, it's a transponster. Oh, it's a trans transponster! The problem that we were having is that these screws w just wouldn't be quite long enough to get through the transponder and into the back of this through the plate and everything. We wouldn't have too much bite and that's not that's not great. So we opted to get some longer screws at the hardware store as well as washers. And can you show me how this snap plate thing works? Yeah, so it's actually the easiest, this is the easiest part of the whole installation. The hardest part is just getting the darn plate on there. Uh, so you have this right here and to, to you know, a normal person is not going to think, they might come up and press it, right? But they're not going to think to push to the side. And what that does is back here, it changes the orientation of these little guys, which grip the louvers right in the front of the Model X. Slide through those louvers, snap it back in place. Now it's attached to your car. And the nice part about it is that it holds the plate completely off the front. So this is going to be holding your plate very firmly, very sturdily off of the front of the car. So it's not going to be touching or anything like that, which is really nice. And of course, when you, if you live somewhere where you don't need a front plate on, or you just, you know, you want to be able to snap it on and off, you can do that really, really easy. And again, it makes install and deinstall very, very fun. And then again, if you wanted to uh, snap this on and leave it on, you take this black screw and you screw it right in here and that would prevent you from turning this. All right, let's do it for real. All right, let's get this plate on here. All right, so we got this all mounted up and I mean, this is a big honking thing here. I don't know if the, uh, if the snap plate was taking that into consideration, but we will see. My fins are a little wonky because I've been using another plate holder that kind of did a little bit of, I don't know, stress to them. Creep is what we call it in the plastics world. Oh, creep. Creep. That should be great. And then, um, yeah, in terms of staying on there, that seems fine. And uh, yeah, if you ever wanted to take it off, really easy. Although then you can't go through any tolls. <laughs> All right, this is the snap plate by livingtesla.com. You can find one uh, for your Tesla there, just in case you really like the front fascia of your car and you don't wanna always have that front license plate on there. Thank you so much for watching, now you know.